Not looking good for old Raffle, is it? Watch this! So, I keep this. I keep this. Do I even keep the Necrim vial? That seems a bit ambitious, but I'm gonna do it. And I wonder if I even keep the Silver, silver Vanguard just so that I can pull it with the Illusionist. I'm gonna do this. Especially with the, the curve that we have, we go Shiny Finder into Weapon, into Illusionist, into win the game. Okay, so our Shiny Finder dies, but it's not really the point of the card. Looks like he's playing the, um, the aggro anything. Oh, it's Vlob! Oh, this is bad. Uh, I need to draw that Phantom Nice pretty quickly here. I yeah, just want to reduce some of the board pressure. Yep. So we kill the crab. Alright, this is a, a bit of a high roll that we're about to hit. Oosh. So we get uh, Kel'Thuzad, potentially, and the Lick King, and Sneeds and Devil Sword. So we've got a lot of outcomes here. Ooh, there we go. That went well. That was a pretty good turn five. Mage? Probably not good. Gonna need the high roll. Which means similar draw to last game. This is not a similar draw to last game. <laughs> okay. I mean, this can do something if we draw it into our Illusionist, but we're likely to just get burned out here. Not looking good for old Raffle, is it? An incredible discovery. If Big Rogue can be optimized a bit more, I think it can be really good, I agree. That's a r really good draw. <laughs> uh, hopefully there's no Potion of Poly, but that's just going to wreck us anyway. I think the best outcome... Right, we've got two out of three for a really good outcome, I think. Basically anything that isn't the, uh, the Charged Devil Sword is good. Honestly, even explosive runs is kind of bad for us, just because. Uh, we have many. Uh, because I want to get value off of this too. Okay, uh, that gives us yet another good outcome. Oh, the Vanguard. Unfortunate. That's decent, though. Kel'Thuzad? Oh, Kel'Thuzad! Dark. Obey the call of 
We are good at Hearthstone. Hmm. I think our opponent quit. Nope. Nope, they're back. Probably confused about the board state. <laughs> oh, this is so stupid. I mean, we pretty much already got all of our minions in play, so I don't think I really need to do much else other than uh, kill the opponent next turn. It could be dead to, like, double fireball over two turns. There isn't really much I can do about that. Got six. I've got lethal. Unless multiple minions are put into play, in which case I'm not dying to the double fireball turn. So, like, opponent somehow has to get, like, multiple minions plus an ice block in. Play. The ice block isn't that unreasonable right now, given that uh, counterspell and explosive runes have already been pulled. Okay. No fireball face, please. Okay. Why make me wait that whole time? Oh, hello there, Barnes. Uh, no, you go back in our deck. You can stay. Well, this is a bit redundant. If we get counterfeit coin, we can Barnes on two. Otherwise, I probably just follow my coin and my curve. Draw the second weapon, set the weapon into Barnes. I don't think I need to be in that big of a hurry because I want to be able to like activate a death rattle potentially. <laughs> oh, literally the worst draw in my deck. It's alright. Zap is good in this matchup. And swing in. Opponent now knows that we have both uh, neck ram blades in hand, or at least should know. Yep. It's at a death rattle. There's only one bad minion outcome here, and it's Cavern Shiny Finder. Alright, this is a good Barnes. Uh, we only have one <laughs> Death Rattle minion left in our, or eight mana minion left in our deck, so I'm just gonna go ahead and pull that out now. And also it's a lethal, so I'm just going to kill our opponent now. Barnes is fine. 